Maite Garcia is the first wife of Prince, and as we commemorate the first year of his passing, we're talking to her about the new book, The Most Beautiful. It's a pleasure to talk with you. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. What made you want to tell your story with Prince? I think it's a beautiful story. I feel like it's filling a void that people have because he was supposedly so mysterious, and um, I wanted to share something beautiful about him. I mean, yes, there's some sad things in it, but it just shows him that he was a human being, funny, and um, kind of a love letter. It's a love story, but it's also a love letter to him. Mai Tai, what made you fall in love with Prince? (laughs) 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 That's funny. That's a funny question. Um, You know, I, I can't pinpoint. I just know that, I mean, of course, yes, he was a musical genius, Come on, you hear his music, you're like, oh, God. (laughs) Um, We had a friendship. He was my first love. I don't know how it happened, but I know it happened, and he fell in love as well. It was was this amazing romance between us. Um, Yeah. (laughs) In your book, The Most Beautiful, you do talk about this amazing love story. You also talk about tragedies inside with the passing of your son, Amir, now, the um, the legendary interview with Oprah Winfrey, I know that it had to be mm-hmm. very difficult for you because you were going through all of this pain. Mm-hmm. It was crazy because it was, um, it was supposed to be a beyond amazing time in our lives. It was the first album that he had, was releasing, Being Free from Warner Brothers, the Emancipation album. We had a commitment to, to be on Oprah, and it was a big deal because he... He didn't do press back. He didn't do a lot of press before before that. And uh, it was unfortunate, uh, the loss of our son. But it was also me supporting him as his wife. I, I wanted to be there for him and, and not have him do this alone. That's what you do when you marry. And it was really hard. But um, I look back at it, and, you know, if you look at the video, we're, we're both holding each other and... and There's a moment where he says, our family exists. And I remember I looked at him and I went, you're right. You're right. And it was was just hope that we needed. Maite Garcia is joining us. The book entitled The Most Beautiful. Maite, outside of music, what really excited Prince? Basketball. (laughs) Basketball. um, He loved dance. He loved uh, comedy. He loved laughing. And... uh, Pretty much music. I mean, he, he said it. It's a blessing and a curse. He, he heard music all the time. I mean, the stuff that he would listen to, uh, you know, in the car and the limo and stuff like that was oldies. He was never, like, I mean, he, he liked some modern stuff that was happening. But, uh, yeah, he just, he just loved playing that guitar and playing that piano and, and being on stage. What were some of his favorite foods? Uh, tostitos. Um, <laughs> Pancakes. Pancakes wow. is real. That whole Dave Chappelle, uh, Charlie Murphy thing, uh-huh. that was real. Like, pancakes. Uh, he, he, he had a sweet tooth, so uh, that was a lot. But I was a ballerina, so, you know, I, I was the one going, that's great. Thanks for eating those donuts in front of me. Thanks. That's <laughs> awesome. I'm going to go eat this lettuce real quick. <laughs> My Tay Garcia is joining us. The book, The Most Beautiful. What do you hope that people get out of you're telling your story of Prince. I'm hoping that they, they get to see another side of him. And that just makes you love him more. I mean, because you, you, get, you get the music, you hear the, the genius in it, you see him on stage, you see the power of, of, of his entire being. But then you also, you, I, I hope that when you read this book, you go, wow, he's a beautiful being. He, he, he loved love. He wanted to start a family. He wanted to be a father. And, and he was funny. Maite Garcia, the book, The Most Beautiful, Your Life with Prince. Thank you for taking time to share your memories with Prince. And as we say around here, because he left us such a great vast of music, he may be gone, but he'll never be forgotten. Maite, thank you so much. Thank you. What?